Good morning, Hoosiers, and welcome to Paper News 24-7, brought to you by the Paper of Montgomery County Online in Living Color from the Paper's Control Room in downtown Crawfordsville. I'm Stu Clampett with your top headlines for Friday, February 4th, 2011. Today's news is brought to you in part by Workforce Plus. Whether you're looking for work or need workers, Workforce Plus can help. Call Workforce Plus at 364-9675. In our top story today, this is expected to be the storm after the storm for local tow truck operators. While they stayed fairly busy during the storm and snow emergency Tuesday and Wednesday, people stayed in those days. Quote, we're booked up solid first thing in the morning, according to Steve Wright, owner of ATS and Newmarket, a towing business. He also said people were stuck in their driveways and wanted to get to work. Calls ranged from normal jump starts due to cold temperatures to calls asking for help getting doors unlocked. Get ready for bitter cold temperatures. The National Weather Service has forecast temperatures dipping as low as one degree above zero at night over the next week. Days are not expected to be warm either, with highs topping out at freezing, if we're lucky. So, how do we protect ourselves and our property from the cold? Well, State Farm has offered several tips to protect your home during frigid temperatures. You can read about them in today's edition of The Paper and on our website, thepaper24-7.com. Paper Trivia is your chance to win prizes by showing off how much you know. If you think you have all the answers, just click on this tile on our homepage and go to the Paper Trivia section, answer the question correctly, and you could win. The Wesley Thrift Shop will be closed until February 9th. The store will reopen on February 10th. The store's regular hours are Wednesday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. and Saturday from 9 a.m. until noon. The store is located at 315 West Market Street. The paper wants to see what you did during the recent snowstorm. Send your photos and videos to fphillips at thepaper24-7.com and we'll publish them in the paper and on our website. For all the talk about fans wanting to see a Super Bowl in a cold weather city, well, we must, just might see it this weekend. The forecast for Dallas, host of the weekend's big game, will be 50 degrees on Sunday. Good thing it's not a Monday night game. The forecast is calling for a high of 37 degrees with a light wintry mix. Frank Phillips' guest this week on Frankly Speaking is Jan Sears from Bernie's Buffet. Frankly Speaking can be found under webcast on the top navigation bar of our website. And don't forget to check our website, thepaper24-7.com, for all your local closing and delay information. Paper News 24-7 is brought to you in part by Workforce Plus. Whether you're looking for work or you need workers, Workforce Plus can help. Call them at 364-9675. Weather and sports are up next. We don't offer washers, paint, or lumber. Floor covering is our expertise for your home or office. At Zahn Floor Covering, we offer luxurious styles of carpeting and realistic looking vinyl patterns, and we do it better than anyone else. You'll fall in love with the possibilities at Zahn's all backed by professional installation, superior personal service, and our three-year installation warranty. Stop by Zons today and see why we want to be everywhere you are. Today looks sunny until midday, then becoming partly cloudy with a high of just about 28. Tonight should be mostly cloudy. We do see a 20% chance of snow after midnight and nearly steady temperatures around 22. Saturday looks mostly cloudy until midday, then becoming partly cloudy with a high around 30. And Saturday night, mostly cloudy skies and a low of 22 degrees. Sunday looks mostly cloudy with a slight chance of snow until midday, then a 30% chance of afternoon snow and a high of 35. Sunday night should be cloudy. We see a 50% chance of overnight snow and a low of 25 degrees. That's your local forecast. Stay tuned for sports in just a moment. I'm Bob Zahn of Zahn's Floor Covering, and floor covering is our passion for your home. At Zahn's, we offer ceramic, granite, marble, laminates, and beautiful natural hardwoods, and we do them better than anyone else. Come by Zahn's Floor Covering, see the flooring possibilities available to your home. All backed by personal service, professional installation, and a three-year warranty. Come by Zahn's Floor Covering today and see why we want to be everywhere you walk.
The IHSAA Swimming Sectional was scheduled for Thursday and it has now been rescheduled Friday night at 5.30 p.m. at Crawfordsville High School. Tonight will be only the prelim races and the finals will be held tomorrow on Saturday. The Southmont girls and boys varsity game against Tri-West was also postponed to Saturday night with a 6 p.m. start. The change was made because Tri-West canceled school on Friday. After starting out so strong on the year, Wabash basketball has hit a bit of a slump as they lost their third consecutive road game last night against Denison. The Little Giants succumbed to Jim LaFue, who threw up seven points in 16 seconds and hit a shot at the buzzer to defeat the Little Giants 65-62. to Wabash will next face number one Wooster on February 5th. A few of the Southmont wrestlers have found a unique way to practice during the past few days. With school being canceled and the wrestlers not being able to get to the school, they have instead been practicing at Fighter Incorporated, a local gym owned by MMA fighter and Southmont grad Danny Surface. That's your local news for Friday. For more information on these and other stories, visit our homepage or pick up a print copy of the paper of Montgomery County. For Paper News 24-7, I'm Stu Clampett.